What's up, everybody? Big Out Triple Six here, the Golf Gamer. So check it out, man. The Last of Us Part Two. Some people loved it. Some people hate it. Myself, honestly, I haven't um, played the game yet. I got spoiled. I even made a video about all all that stuff. Some people hate the story, but enjoyed the gameplay. Like hands down, enjoyed the gameplay of it. Um, all the people I talked to at work and stuff. Did not like the story, but they enjoyed the fucking gameplay. And I beat the first one. The first one's it's great. It really is. Um, I enjoyed Ellie. The character Ellie was great from the first one. I totally enjoyed her. She was pretty fucking cool from the from the beginning and and end. The DLC not so much. It was kind of kind of meh. But some IGN frauds say that's the best DLC ever. Nah. The DLC for Assassin's Creed, uh, Assassin's Creed Origins was so much better, in my opinion. But, um, so, you guys need to follow Warrior64 and Cheap Ass Gamer. One, they had the best freaking sales. I, I'm, I'm going to show you, like, at least two items. This one I'm about to open right now. And also another one. And also right now, Gamefly is having a freaking sale on their items. I did not know they sold 4K movies. So guess what, guys? <laughs> You're getting more freaking coats. <laughs> so yeah, Gamefly, it's freaking amazing, man. I don't I don't buy, you know, I don't have the new shit or anything. I just have their, I just buy stuff from their website all the time. I've been doing it for about the beginning of the PS4. So that's about, what, seven years? Hey, Google. When did the PS4... Hey, Google. Hey, Google. When did the PS4 come out? So, yeah. So that's a long fucking time. Hey, Google. Shut up. Hey, Google. Shut up. All right, you, you you talk you talk too much, but damn, but yeah. Um, let me get this mofo out the box, out the way here. Uh, 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 so get the, get the fuck out the way. All right, <laughs> but yeah, this right here, focus, focus, goddamn it. All right, this is the um, Naughty Dog PlayStation Edition, GameStop Edition of Ellie. Let me scroll out. There you go. A little bit. Uh, apparently, this version right here was um, not the biggest one they had. the The PlayStation Direct had the official, you know, big version of this Ellie statue. This is basically the the cheaper model, actually. So I got this mofo for thirty bucks, and I even do have the. Controller right here that I bought as well. That's what's part two controller collector edition controller that I thought that was pretty cool because um, I sort of broke the broke the no, no, I break it The the analog stick was kind of kind of worn the fuck down So I'm not gonna open this just yet. I have a bunch of other action figures. I haven't opened yet I got a I got a Harley Quinn. I got a poison ivy. I got Batgirl because those you guys need to follow warrior 64 and um Cheap ass gamer because they always have some good fucking sales. And also, another thing that I bought. I'm not a big fan of Christmas ornaments, but um, I had to pick this up. Had to pick this up because, you know, only for one thing. Yeah. I couldn't pass that up, man. No fucking way. When I saw that, I was like, yeah. I definitely had to pick this mofo up big time, big time. It was worth it. Um, you could check on Hallmark's um, keepsake. They gave me a fucking bag, which I didn't, I didn't want, actually. <laughs> there it is right there. They gave me a fucking bag, which my girlfriend probably do something with it. I, 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 don't, I don't freaking care. But, yeah, I had to pick that mofo up because it, it, it played the sounds. And I'm telling I'm telling you right now. This is the superior Mario game. Not Mario 3, not Mario 2, not the first Mario. This one was a top king. Then right after that, Mario 64. Fuck Galaxy, fuck Sunshine. All right? This is superior. 
superior. Period. Come at me, motherfuckers. But yeah. <laughs> I got that mofo on Warrior 64. And it's, it's, it's a great, great ornament. My girlfriend, like, freaking saw the video of it. She's like, yeah, get that. Get that, honey. Get that. So I did. Um, they also have um, also Mario stuff, Donkey Kong. Um, I think I think Mortal Kombat. Just just follow Warrior Six Four on Twitter, and you'll find out what I mean. But also, I loved the game Mirror's Edge. So I waited and waited and waited for the collector edition. Of Mirror's Edge. I got this mofo for about 40 bucks. And um, yeah. I do have the collector edition. Um, bag. For the first one. Uh, the reason why I love Mirror's Edge. I actually like the character Faith. I actually thought she was a pretty cool character. Especially for the first one. When I first saw the trailer. Of Mirror's Edge. I thought this was like a amazing game. And it was, it was something different. Even the song. Um, still alive. I always liked that song. It was very, very soothing. And I don't know what it is with that song. It just, it just sounds amazing. But I always wanted to get this um, statue for the longest time, and now I finally have it. Now I have the collector edition bag I got for free. Thank you, Jeff. Uh, now I have the statue, so I'm happy. <laughs> but um, anyways, I bought some more stuff that I'm trying, trying to collect. I actually got High Rewards. I know they have for the Switch, but I want to get this for the for the Wii U so I actually complete my my collection of the Wii U games. And also, I was eyeing this mofo. This is the actually the the um um uncut version compared to the Switch version. This is the uncut version that everybody actually try to seek for. I got this on clearance for ten dollars, and I got that mofo eBay for like I think like twelve or thirteen bucks. So yeah, I had to get this one because it's the uncut version. I will be getting the switch version with uh, uh, um, maybe a year or two, maybe three years. It, when it goes down later, maybe like ten to fifteen bucks, I'll get it. Uh, the switch version, and also, so my switch collection is complete. I don't need any more. No, my Wii U collection is complete. Sorry. Um, now. I am trying to collect my PlayStation 1 games. I think I need two more um, PS2 games, but my PS3 collection is complete that I'm looking for. But I'm trying to collect my PS1 games. I still need to collect Parasite Eve 1. I have two. I need to get Dino Crisis 2. I have the first one. Um, I do need to get Tekken 2 and 3. And a few more games. I just finally got my, the first Soul Reaver game. The Soul Reaver series is complete. So, yeah, I'm slowly trying to collect my PS1 games. I still need to get Apes, Apes Odyssey and stuff like that. But you guys are not here for all this bullshit. You guys are here for the movies. <laughs> but, um, yeah, man. I always like giving you guys the digital, digital code because, to be honest, I'm not going to use them. I have no reason for it, and I'll always say over and over again, physical media movies will always be superior. Even my girlfriend freaking knows the difference. <laughs> I sort of corrupted her to tell the difference between streaming and actual physical movies. So I got Daddy's Home. I actually liked the first one. I did not like the second one. And 47 um, Ronan. Running, what do you want to call it? And also, I just bought from GameFly, which I didn't know they sold movies. Now I have um, Bad Boys for Life. It was like ten dollars, so it should come with the digital code. If not, I'll, I'll let you guys know um, on Twitter and let you guys know on you know the comment section on YouTube. But anyways, let me let me stop talking. Get you guys a code. But yeah, I mean, I did like Daddy's Home. Uh, actually. Um, didn't didn't know. I didn't think Mark Wal Mark Wahlberg would be actually be a comedian, to be honest. But after I saw him in the movie Two Guns, which is actually a good movie, he was actually pretty fucking funny. 
So, yeah. <laughs> so, I actually enjoyed Will Ferrell and freaking Mark Warburg. Now, I love Keanu Reeves. I love him in The Matrix. I do have um, John Wick 1, 2, and 3. I haven't watched the third one yet. But um, I do like Keanu Reeves. He's he's a he's a pretty decent actor and stuff. Um, what other movie he played in? I did like him in Speed. Um, that's the only movies I could recall him in. John Wick, Matrix, Speed, this movie. Fuck, what other good movie he played in? Huh? Let me know in the comment section below. You guys could actually name a few. But yeah, man. Here's the code for it. I actually thought this movie was actually really good. Um, it's actually worth watching. But if you're looking for some more um, 4K movies, the PS5 will work with 4K. If you get the physical copy, the Xbox Series X runs 4K. Always get the physical copy. It'll be it'll be in a good quality. And also try to get the best 4K TV. Seriously. It, 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 either if, if it has to be mid range, don't get the ones at Walmart. All right, do not get the ones at Walmart. Go to Best Buy, spend about if you have enough money, spend about freaking $800 if you can, $800 or up. Because in, the next TV I'm trying to get, dude, is gonna be a QLED. Me and my girl already talked about, about the stuff. I'm going to have a warranty and stuff because she's worried about the about the burning and stuff. I've talked to a bunch of people. Um, I've talked to Heart Eight Times and everybody else that's on Twitter about the stuff and what they need to do. I should be all right. But anyways, that's about it, guys. I'm going to be putting that in somewhere special. I do have Tomb Raider action figures. I uh, just haven't opened those yet. But, um, yeah, I'm happy that I got that. Got a couple of movies. I might watch Daddy's Home after I shave and maybe this movie too. I don't think my girl watched this movie before. She's not a big um, um, movie person, to be honest. But um, I actually watched The Breakfast Club for the first time ever. I, I How about this? I, I, I say The Breakfast Club is better than The Goonies. There, I, I said it. <laughs> I said The Goonies wasn't that good. But it's not, it's not, The Breakfast Club is not better than, um, Bueller's days off. I guess that's what it is. Like, oh yeah, oh yeah, something like that. Bueller's day off. So you guys, you oh, the older people like me know what I'm talking about. But I, I, I need to get out of here. I'm probably gonna freaking um, go shave. Well, definitely go shave and um, pretty much put all this stuff up. But anyways, guys, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section below. And yeah, man, I'll talk to you guys later. Wear your mask, stay awesome, and don't play games on easy mode. You're a fraud then. This is Big Ox Triple Six. Y'all stay awesome. I'll see you guys next time. Get see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye guys. Have a good one.